I think today I've realized what <laughs> today it's taken till today to realize <laughs> may have just kicked over my garbage can uh, how random my conversations are with people I mean today I was showing someone my house because I need to sublet it since I'm moving and <laughs> just some of the things I said to her like for example one point we were downstairs looking at the laundry room and I just I felt it necessary to mention that there's a washer and a dryer. She can clearly see these things. But I mentioned to her that there's a washer and a dryer. And I was like, oh, and someone's left their things on the dryer. Oh, wait. Are those my laundry? Is that my laundry? Yes, it is. Oh, well, I'm just going to grab this while we're down here. Oh, I'm sorry, person who's showing me their house. Yeah, just grab your laundry while we're down here. That must have been what she was thinking. That would make sense. That would be a normal person's thought, thought process. What was mine? Oh, well, this has been down here for a bit. I should probably grab it. And I'm, I'm, I'm not even one of those people who leaves stuff in the washer, you know, or in the dryer. So why is that even down there? Realistically, I think I did some laundry the other day. It wasn't too long ago. It was enough time that, like, it's surprising that it's still there. I've also shown the house to, like, two different people while my stuff's been down there and I haven't thought to bring it up and now all of a sudden I'm down there and I'm like oh let's just grab this let's just bring this upstairs to my bedroom so then so we're going I always show the middle of the house and the bottom and then the bedroom kind of finish with the bedroom it's the best part if you're asking me I mean look at it beauty don't know how to make a bed though that's the situation there don't know how to make a bed regardless um, so yeah, so I usually finish with the bedroom. I completely missed the middle bathroom. And that's where you shower, realistically. That's where I shower. And so I was just like, oh yeah, I've completely forgot to show you that. You don't need to see that, do you? You don't need to know where you're showering. I think showering is probably one of the, one of the things you would want to know. Do I really need to see the laundry room? Eh, it's nice to know that it's there. Don't need to see it. Bathroom that I'm showering in probably want to see that. So I mean, my priorities when I'm showing this house are very skewed. Also, I like to throw in jokes so people don't think I'm funny. Like, and the worst part is they're not even living with me. So it doesn't really matter if they're funny. But I feel so personally offended when I'm giving this tour and they don't laugh. It's similar. I used to, when I used to be a tour guide at the university, it was a similar situation. I mean, when people don't laugh at your jokes, it's just like, well, what am I here for? You know, like you could walk around this campus by yourself. You can read the signs. You know, it clearly says science complex, university center. I think you can probably figure it out on your own. What I come here with, what I provide are clearly the jokes and potentially some sort of knowledge. But like I wasn't that knowledgeable of a tour guide. I mean, I read the pamphlet, but you could also just read read the university website. I don't want this to turn into a into a rant on why people take university tours. I've, I have always wondered that. I mean, especially the people who don't even come into the residences. Because that is, that is the one thing that I as a tour guide provided, you know? Like, I had the keys to the, rever the residences. And so I would show you a couple of residences. But sometimes, like, we only showed certain residences. And I'd often take requests. Which residents would you like to go see? This makes sense. Uh, but sometimes I would just decide, like, mm, these ones are close together. I don't want to put too much effort into this job. And we got paid the same regardless. So why do extra work, you know? Like, why walk across campus? Anyway, I <laughs> bet you're wondering why I'm not a tour guide anymore. Anyway, so now back to this house. When I'm giving tours of my house, I'm like, why are, you not, why are you not laughing at my jokes? So the girl today, she laughed at all my jokes, made me feel better about myself, thought it was a great tour. Now, I feel like I'm going to be personally offended if she doesn't take this house because she laughed at my jokes. Anyway, I don't know why, though, because, like, who cares if she's laughing at my jokes? They're obviously awful jokes. I mean, like, that's, that's my Twitter bio. Steady stream of bad jokes. It's basically like a leaky faucet of bad jokes. I mean, it's a... You get the idea. You get the idea. Whatever. It's one of those days.